Welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Linda. If you're new here, I am on WW, which is Weight Watchers, and I follow the Blue Plan. I've got another What I Eat in a Day for you guys. Um, big surprise. Um, but yes, I have another What I Eat in a Day, but this one is a little different. Um, today, I am going to be eating out all day long. So basically, um, I am going to be eating out um, kind of just going with the flow, whatever the family wants and sounds good to me. And I'm just going to order what sounds good to me and try to keep within my portions. Now, keeping within my points, that's gonna be, you know, I only get 23 points a, a day on the blue plan and I get 28 weeklies. And however many fit points I have, you know, from how I accumulate them through the day from moving around. So with that, 23 and 28. So I don't normally tap into my weeklies. Um, I'm normally in the blue dot range where I'm kind of in the healthy eating range, like 90% of the time. So uh, it's very rare that I even use my weeklies, but I do use them. And when I do use them, I use them. So today, I have a feeling that I am gonna be using my weeklies. So let's go ahead and get started on what I ate today. Okay, you guys, so I decided to get the Egg McMuffin. So I normally, basically this is what I normally get. This is what I normally do. I like the Egg McMuffin. Um, you know, I looked at some of the other items or whatever, and I really didn't feel like trying anything new or anything because i'm like thinking i love i just love the egg mcmuffin i like the english muffin i like the little ham i like the egg i like the cheese i like everything about this so that's what i went with now i did get this hash brown now whether or not i'm going to eat the whole thing or not i don't know but i'm definitely going to taste it so let's see how many because let's see how many points that this is Okay, so <clears throat> I decided to cut the hash brown in half and only eat half of it and give the other part to my son. So basically this Egg McMuffin was eight and then half of this is two. So all together, this was 10 smart points. And of course, when I have McDonald's, I gotta have a soda. So I have this diet caffeine free soda. It's a smaller one. Somebody's phone's going off at the table. Anyway, so... um. That's what we got for breakfast at McDonald's. So this is what I have going on. We went to a local hamburger place and I decided to share a hamburger with Swiss cheese. I have a few little fries, one fried pickle, one onion ring and sauteed jalapenos and um, onions. And I'll have a little bit of this ranch with my fries. So I'm not sure how many points this is, I will find out after I eat it, but I am excited to have this because I haven't had it in a while. And I think the portions look very respectful. So I'm gonna enjoy it. We decided to go to a local restaurant, Little Mom and Pop, and they have a catfish. So I got two pieces of catfish, I got some coleslaw and some green beans, and they gave me some tartar sauce. I don't know if I'll eat that, I usually eat Tabasco with it. So I am not sure if I'm gonna eat both of these or one and a half, um, but we'll see what happens. So this is gonna be really good. This is a treat. I haven't had catfish in a minute, so I'm excited. Okay guys, well that was everything I had today. Um, I hope you liked this video. Um, I know that the choices that I had for eating out were not the healthiest choices, but that is me being realistic on using my all my points, the 23 points and all my weeklies, uh, 28 weeklies, although I only used, um, Actually, I only had 16 weeklies left after all that. 
Um, so I didn't use all my weeklies, but I tapped into it and I did use all of my um, 23 points that I get a day on the blue plan. So like I said, I hope you found this video helpful. Basically, I just tried to keep within my portions as far as, you know, the plate method where, you know, I, on one meal, you know, I shared to keep the portions down. Yes, I had French fries, but I didn't have all of them in a large, you know, I just, I had a little bit. I wanted to taste the fried pickle, so I had one. You know, I wanted to taste the onion ring, so I had one. I wanted a little bit of ranch, so I had a little bit of ranch. You know, so I hope, like I said, I hope you found this helpful because sometimes I think that, you know, um, we worry too much about being, you know, perfectionists in our diet or anything that we do. I know that I do. And sometimes I think it's good for me to kind of just, you know, kind of let your hair down and just go for it. Um, so that's pretty much what I did today. And I enjoyed myself. I enjoyed every minute of it. And tomorrow I will be right back on track because I've worked too hard to get where I'm at. You know, I'm down 31.8 pounds. It took me a long time to get here. I still have a ways to go. I'm not there. I'm not at my goal weight yet. And that's okay. But you know, sometimes you gotta stop and smell the roses and enjoy life a little bit. And that's, you know, what I did today. So I hope you found this video helpful. I hope this gave you some ideas on like when you wanna go out and you wanna splurge, even if it's just for one meal, you know, treat yourself, don't beat yourself up, you know, have what you wanna have within reason. And then the next day, just get back up and start again, cause that's what I'm gonna do. I had my enjoyment, I had, you know, I'm not having any snacks after all of this. Because I had, I feel full, I feel, can you know, content, I don't feel hungry, you know, so that's, you know, I'm just going to bounce right back tomorrow and keep doing it. So thank you so much for watching this video, you guys. I hope it gave you some ideas and I will see you guys in the next one.